Understanding Moral Decay in Today's World Hello and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to talk about a rather serious but important phrase, moral decay. We'll explore what it means, how it's used, and its implications in society. So, let's dive in and get a better understanding of this compelling concept. Moral decay refers to the gradual deterioration of moral values in a society. This could mean an increase in behaviors that are considered unethical or immoral, such as dishonesty, corruption, or lack of respect for others. It's a phrase often used to describe a society that is seen as losing its traditional ethical beliefs. To illustrate moral decay, we can look at examples from various areas of life, such as politics, where corruption and deceit might become more common, or in social interactions, where people may show less empathy and respect for one another. It's often a topic of discussion in news media when talking about societal issues. There are many factors that can contribute to moral decay. These can include technological advancements that lead to less face-to-face -face interaction, economic hardships that increase survival based in ethical behavior, or cultural shifts that change what behaviors are considered acceptable. The consequences of moral decay can be quite severe. They can lead to a breakdown in social cohesion, an increase in crime, and generally a less pleasant society to live in. Understanding these consequences is vital to recognizing the importance of maintaining strong moral values. Combating moral decay involves promoting ethical education, strengthening community ties, and encouraging individuals to reflect on their actions and the impact they have on others. It's about nurturing a society that values integrity, respect, and empathy. We hope this video has given you a clearer understanding of the phrase, moral decay, and why it's a significant topic of discussion in many societies. Remember, Languages are not just about words, but also about the values and ideas they represent. Until next time, keep learning and stay curious.